Hello, my name is Holly Cheek and I'm an Applications Engineer for Hogwarts Systems. In today's video, we will be covering displaying different render modes with your main model in that detailed digger view. There are a couple different ways we can do this. I already have views predefined with some different render modes on that main model there. So I'm going to have just my first view selected and in order to create this, I want the start render mode to be the render mode that I want that detailed digger view to be placed in. So I currently have just a smooth one here so I can hit my space bar to bring up my digger tool and then we'll just accept that one to create that actor there. The render mode for both actors currently in the viewport are the same. Now to update the model along the background for a different render mode, I just need to go to the render tab along the ribbon along the top and I can change that to maybe that technical one there, that way I have those edges shown in the main model and the edges are not shown in that detailed digger view. Let's go ahead and update that view to save that view out. The next option I have for creating the different render modes for the detailed digger view in the main model is to actually use an update views with actor selected. So I want to select the actor that I want to push to another view. Then I'm going to hold control and select that view that I want to push that into. Then the fourth icon over in the views tab on that left pane there, that's the update view with the selected actor. So I can select that and it will push the actor that I had created in this view six into that view seven there. So now if I activate that one, I can see that I have my smooth edges with kind of more of my flat render mode for that background. In today's video, we cover displaying different rendering modes with your main model and that detailed digger view. Thanks for watching.